welcome in story time before we start thank you to the gadigal and wangal people of the era nation for letting us share your land we promise to look after it the animals and people too hello land hello sky hello you and hello me so hi i am ruchi today me and mamta are sharing story time on diwali where we tell you about diwali stories and share some songs from india so here i am going to share a song about the diwali in my language which is hindi aai diwali aai diwali aai diwali re deep jalao khushi manao aai diwali re aai diwali aai diwali aai diwali re खूब चले फुल जड़ी और पटाके आई दिवाली रे आई दिवाली आई दिवाली आई दिवाली रे सबको बाटो खूब मिठाई आई दिवाली रे हेलो आई एम ममता टुडे वी गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट दिवाली एज रुचि से सो व्हाट इज दिवाली व्हाट डू यू नो अबाउट दिवाली दिवाली इज फेस्टिवल ऑफ लाइट्स एंड there's another definition for diwali too it's called a row of lamps because on diwali day the houses shops our backyards everything is lit with tiny little lamps called diyas so now i'm going to share some songs which my grandmother used to sing with me so this song is about the counting which i first shared in hindi and then i will sing in english as well so you can understand little bit better dhobi aaya dhobi aaya kitne kapde laaya 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 10 10 10 10 10 now i am going to sing same song in english laundry man came laundry man came he brought how many clothes 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 10 10 10 mate 10 10 10 so now did you learn counting in hindi did you was it a fun let's sing a song about a horse it's in hindi you know india has many languages 17 official languages and hindi is one of them and come on let's sing this song about a horse we are telling it which direction it can go chal mere go de chal 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 mere go de chal 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 hi hi karke nahi macho hi hi karke nahi macho chal mere go de chal 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 mere go de chal 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 baaye chal ya daaye chal baaye chal ya daaye chal chal mere go de chal 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 mere go de chal 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 idhar udhar tu nahi batak idhar udhar tu nahi batak chal mere go de chal 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 mere go de chal 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 so now the other song which is um, related to fish it's also in hindi machli jal ki rani hai jeevan uska pani hai haath lagaoge to dar jayegi bahar nikaloge to mar jayegi now the story behind the celebration of diwali diwali is celebrated not like christmas every doesn't come on a fixed date like christmas which is on 25th december diwali comes usually in october or november depends on the moon and but one thing is fixed though it's always on a new moon day and this year it's going to be on 14th november i'm very excited about it now the story long long ago and many ages ago there lived a warrior prince called rama he married a beautiful princess by name sita and an evil king by name ravana he lived nearby 
You know how many heads he had? He had 10 heads. Imagine having 10 heads. And if someone has 10 heads, how many hands would they have? Do you think 10? No, 20 hands. So one day, what that evil king Ravana did was, he went to Rama's house and made sure that Rama was away and then captured Sita and took her in his chariot to his palace. So Rama realized that his wife Sita is mo missing and then what do you think he has done? He started looking for her in the forest and everywhere. Sita, Sita, where are you? Then in that process, he, he met monkey god called Hanuman. So together they became good friends and Hanuman promised Rama that he would look for his wife Sita. So Hanuman jumped all the way and everywhere, went landed in Sri Lanka and he found her imprisoned in a beautiful garden called Ashoka One. Then he went and back, Hanuman went back to Rama and told that he saw Sita in that Ashokavan garden. Both Rama and Ravana got together their armies and then waged a battle against Ravana. It was a huge battle. It took 10 days. People thought that Rama is not going to win. Rama had a magical weapon, which is an arrow. He took it out from his quiver and aimed at Ravana and fell him down onto the ground. And Rama won, took his wife Sita back to his kingdom called Ayodhya. And when he reached his kingdom, it was a new moon day. And do you think there were lights, electricity in those days? No, and it was pitch dark. People were so happy to see their king come back, so they lit lamps all the way to his palace to guide them to their palace. And that's the story behind Diwali. And the reason we light lamps on Diwali day. And another song is related to moon. When um, your child is a bit upset, you sing that song to make your child happy. So it goes like that. Chanda ma ma dur ke, pue pakaave bur ke, aap khaye thali me, aur munne ko de piali me, piali gai toot, munna gaya root. Laayenge nai pialiya, baja baja ke taliya. When I was a kid of your age, I used to play with this song with my friends, like we used to go around in circles or we used to clap with them and sing this song. Are you ready to clap with me today? Come, let's sing, sing this song. Chamma chekka charadesi mogga atlubo yanga aragin changa mutyala chamma chekka mugule yanga ratanala chamma chekka rangule yanga panditlo ma bava pelliche yanga that was so much fun, isn't it? Like, you brought back me the memories of my childhood. I'm going to share a very popular tale from India, which my grandmother used to tell me when I was at your age. So it goes like that. There was a crocodile who lived in a lake surrounded by big mountains, green grass, and very sweet jamun tree. And do you know who lived on that tree? A very happy and cheeky monkey. So monkey and crocodile became very good friends. As crocodile visited every day to monkey and monkey offered him a very sweet jamun fruits. One day crocodile took those jamun fruits to his wife. After eating those sweet fruits, his wife said, Imagine how sweet the monkey's heart would taste who eat those jamun fruits every day. I want to eat his heart. Can you bring him tomorrow at home? 
Next a crocodile went to monkey and invited him on lunch to his place. Monkey accepted his offer but said, how will I come? I don't know how to swim. Crocodile offered him a ride on his back. So monkey and crocodile went to his place. As soon as they reached to the middle of the river, crocodile told monkey about his wife's plan to eat his heart. Monkey had all of a sudden a very clever idea to escape. He said, oh my dear friend, why didn't you tell me before? I left my heart on tree. Can we go back and bring my heart? Foolish crocodile believed him and took him back to tree. As soon as they reached nearby the tree, monkey jumped and escaped. And foolish crocodile was waited, waited, waited very long and did get nothing and lost his best friend. That is the end of the story. So how do we celebrate Diwali? What do we do on that day? As a kid, I remember, we wake up quite, wake up quite early in the morning, shower, wear new clothes, and then we used to have a race, you know, like who is going to go out to the house and burst the crackers? That's the main fun behind Diwali celebrations. Of course, we have plenty of sweets, special meals, and play with friends and relatives. And in the evening, we open the doors, windows, so that Goddess Lakshmi, the Goddess of Wealth, comes in and gives us prosperity and health. And according to my neighbor, Sunny, Diwali means sparklers, Diwali means sweets, and finally Diwali means lots of candles. That's how we celebrate Diwali in Australia with our neighbors and friends. Remember, always be with a grown-up when you're using sparklers and lighting candles or lamps because safety is important. Now I'm going to share a goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye and cheerio, cheerio. Cheerio, bye, goodbye, and cheerio, and have a lovely day. Do you know that we do have a Hindi collection in our library? So where you can come and borrow the books, or you can share books online as well from our e-resources.